Hello to all and to all hello. My name is B Red. Um you all know me by now. Um right, I'm gonna go straight into it. We got the map packs there on what day was that? Tuesday. I was really looking forward to them and I was afraid they were not gonna be as good as I thought they were gonna be, especially as a Philly Ward fucked up for the first couple of hours and getting them out there. But I am actually really happy with it. Um this map in particular is probably my favourite. Um, I think this is my first or second game on this map, no joke. Uh, so, and it turned out pretty well. I got 36 and 2. And it's a demolition game, so I know a lot of people are stick, sick of, uh, you know, watching, you know, bleh, domination, team day match, all that arse. But, um, yeah, the map's uh, probably my least favourite would be Storm. I don't know why, I just never liked the rain type map thingies. But, uh Everything else is pretty good. I love Salvage. Um, this map is probably my favourite out of the whole package and Crash. But um, I knew what Crash and Overground were like, so I was happy they're coming back. Overground seems to play out a lot better on this game. Um, the map, like, it kind of favours games like um, Capture the Flag and stuff. It just seems to be a lot like more exciting, seeing as uh, you have a full map to run around to the other corner to get the flag back. And I don't know, it's great with the weapons, I think, that they implemented in this game. You're not just stuck with just the M16 and the snipers on that map. You actually have like, um, like LMGs and stuff. I've seen a lot of people use LMGs. I haven't really gone into LMGs myself anyway. But on this map, I am using an M16. The only reason I'm using it is because I see I was hosting. I was like, boy, yeah, it gives a couple of one, uh, one burst uh, kills. So, and seeing as I was, I was only learning the maps, I thought I'd just go ahead and use it because I didn't really know what else to use. But, um, yeah, it turned out pretty well. Noob is gone, yeah, but what you're going to do, I'm just going to put up a good score video and hopefully you, enjoy, you guys will enjoy. And I'm stuttering all over the place today, so. <laughs> but um, Demolition is not really my game type. Um, I kind of stick to the ground war, TDM, domination, but uh, anything else seems to be out of my league unless I'm in a party because if you're not at a party when playing, you get raped. So I just guess it's up to the general Call of Duty community now how these maps should actually play out throughout, uh, well, over the next while because that hour, I was very scared when I first got the map pack and I ended up going into private match and walking around the maps and there seemed to be a lot of tight corners and places to hide and that fucking dog house on the salvage, that is some laugh. I know it's like... You just get the whole team to try hide in there, <laughs> it's funny, but like, I hope it doesn't turn into one fucking cunt sitting in there randomly like every time you go by it or I don't know, salvage just seems even though it's a small map it seems like a little fucking sneaky cunt like it will just come up behind you and be there with his commando and his lightweight and his marathon run around knife and uh shotguns are probably your best bet on a map like that. Um or I use the MP five K because that's probably the strongest uh Submachine gun, uh, close like you would kill the quickest because it's uh, fucking what do you call it? What am I saying? Fire rate, yeah, there you go. Um, or even a, I was thinking the other day, well, not the other day, like as in yesterday, um, if you get a Kimbo P90s or anything a Kimbo at Kimbo SMGs on map like Savage, it could come very like very useful because shotguns, like. Yeah, you can kill whatever, but sometimes you're out of range and you can't get them. But uh, things like Akimbo SMGs, as I just said, like you know, they have a bit more range and obviously they have the power. Not as powerful as a uh, shotgun, but they could, like you know, they're still fucking heftily powerful. So if you run around with that damn on a map like uh, Salvage, then I say it could turn out to be a pretty good game. So as you just saw, I kept my Predator missile on to the next round to see if I can get. Uh, quad or whatever but I ended up getting two people but I just noticed there when I called in that predator missile there's a couple of cars back where they spawn so obviously they're going to be spawning there spawning there for uh, demolition and capture the flag so make sure you always save your predator missile because you could easily get a quad or six man whatever for, with that like seeing as the cars are already there at their spawn so fortunately I, 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 yeah. I can't talk today um, 
I was saying, unfortunately, there's only two people there, so I ended up taking those two out. But I don't know, I can't complain. I was pretty lucky to get such a good match. Um, nobody seems to know what they're doing, and I feel sorry for the fucking idiots that decide to run down the middle road of this. It's probably the stupidest thing you can do. The whole map, I'd say, you know, when it's meant to be central points of the maps and shit like that, and nobody knew what they're going to be. For Bailout, I'd say, is. You know, obviously in between where I am now and across the way, um, up on that little uh, high rise, if you know what I mean. Um, so that road kind of, uh, no, it's kind of like, this map kind of reminds me of Crossfire. Um, I don't know if it's just me, but it's just like a main road and they're fighting between each side. So um, I was going to talk about another, something else, what was it? Oh yeah, 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 the update that came with the map pack, I heard that they improved uh, the matchmaking system. So when you go and look for a match, you won't be fucking paired up with like, like you know, someone from Japan and someone from Australia and then some other guy from America or whatever. They try to look for local, uh, so it actually works. I it, I have been on great connection and um, I went into a free-for-all game, not in the stimulus package, but I just went on and... Uh, went for a free-for-all in the normal and uh, it got into a full game of Irish people every single person was Irish and we we're actually all talking there in the lobby saying like what the fuck every single one of us are Irish and um, so the matchmaking was improved greatly they did tweak the one-man army uh, perk I, I can't notice it but um, i just seen your man 402's Twitter and he said that they changed that and they took out the gold desert eagle from that people have uh, glitched for which i was pretty pissed off about i only have one class that i was going to keep that on but i think there's a way of getting that back so meh um yeah but there's still a lot of things they didn't fix obviously the whole one man army situation um nuke boosters uh i don't know i can't complain too much because i actually think if any war make a, well did a good job on these map packs so you know that's something good. All right, 36 and 2, final score. Um, go to my channel, check me out. I post quite regularly. Um, you best, Ray. And yeah, thank you very much. I'm the bread, you're the butter. Take it easy. Slan lat. That means goodbye in Irish, by the way. Bye.